head of the fake Albanian investigative agency stopped crime. Her cold in a bad place. After contacting the hospital where he was hospitalized, we were told that the patient was simply trying to justify not showing up in the instances for the allegations of fraud or the amount of from 900 to 11,000 of euros by citizen Marius Mariovi in Greece, a citizen with the initials GK in Austria, to whom they returned only 700 euros out of 1,400 that had been taken from him with the deception that they would make him a policeman and a secret agent and and some other citizens from other different countries of the world. Fatmirsena became famous after the denunciations of the citizens to the Hellenic State Police in Greece for being threatened with knife in throat for the purpose to withdraw the denunciation for fraud with the amount of 11,000 euros. Recently, Elvira Lani, the former general director of Stop Crime Association under the superficial orders of the present in picture Albanian Fatmir Sena, later on replaced by another female protagonist of sexual scandals in public places filmed by the security cameras of a supermarket, Albanian citizen Heroina Cristorucci, the successor of Elvira Lani, who was actually arrested and trialed by the Albanian Criminal Court for the criminal offense of repeated fraud with various amounts of money trying to present herself as a representative of a CIA and FBI equivalent agency that actually is registered in Albania as an NGO, which despite appearing in the Albanian state registered as an NGO, finds the courage to appear in the well-known media presenting itself as an international genuine investigative agency equivalent to the CIA, FBI and KGB. But why all this fuss with pretending to be CIA and FBI agents with an NGO office based in the well-known woodland era of the Roma nationality Albanians in Alias Ara in Tirana, the capital of Albania? Because after creating an association to collect humanitarian aids for the real purpose of hiding and justifying money of affairs like the one with over one million of dollars obtained from the passports production tender, for which the Albanian former general director of the state police Vedim Ftari was sentenced, and other big money fraud stories like the one with over 3.5 millions of euros of fraud committed against the Italian state by the lawyer Natasha Shehu, another Albanian of the same NGO who was practically sentenced in Italy to six months and a fine of 300 of thousands of euros. The members of this association were arrested several times in a row for the way the NGO was collecting money through fraud and threats with knives in throat and corrupt Albanian police officers who created this criminal gang began to use the NGO for the purpose to sell false documents as secret agents but also as a mediating point of action corruption between those arrested for various criminal offenses and the Albanian state police. Whenever the lawyers also arrested for various criminal offenses who also take part in this camouflage as an NGO, but practically a criminal organization, find criminal clients that are in big trouble with the Albanian state police, the NGO of Fatmir Sena and ex-police director Veli Muftari mediate with the actual empowered heads of the state police and the case get magically closed. The payment for the mediation between the criminals in trouble and the Albanian state police goes immediately in the donation box of offers of the Mersena and the Limestari NGO and no one ever finds out how much money practically goes to the police under the table.